Oh, heavens no. For hours. Oh, nose to the grindstone, you know. Then why haven't I heard a single whoosh through the door since ten o'clock? Did you forget we're having Deirdre's birthday party? Oh. We've got a pinata. Right. Brilliant. Of course. Have you forgotten your joy? <laughs> of course not. Snug as a bug on a drug. Well, come on then, finish up. Uh, just have a few more pages. I, I, I know you're very busy. Then don't take too long to finish. Aha! The power cell's empty. Well, what will you do? I'll get a new one. That without a ripple in one's teacup. How does she know? Well, I expect you in the conference room presently. Don't dawdle. You don't want to miss the pinata. Um, wasn't Prudence supposed to be coming back today? I made right. Do you think the canister wonders what life's like outside the tube? Of course he'd have to break the tube to get out. Well, that would break it for everybody. Shit. 
He wants my view. to you, Prudence. You're not coming back, are you, Prue? But where did you go? your joy, Pro. I mean, you too. behind in our work now that you mention it. <laughs> Pinata. It's the most adorable Spanish custom. Uncle Jack did a whole show about it. You smash it until all the sweets come out. Come on, hit it! Hit it! Hit it! Hit it! You are off your joy. Take one of mine. Oh my lord. He's a downer. Oh, Call security. Down. We've got a downer. Take your joy. 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 Take your jo
probably a bad time to ask for that raise. You smell gas? Flame and Nora. Forget him, there's no time! Uh, Christ, I thought those bastards chased me. There were bridges, weren't there? And tunnels. I'm pretty sure I'm not in the parade anymore. I don't even think I'm still in the village. Well, I'm not getting out that way.
gather around the telly for a rousing round of Simon Says. There we go. Three years of the salamander and me getting into constant trouble finally pay off. Prudence really did run off, and she ran this way. I wonder if I'll see her again. to him, or rather who. to hurt you, Percy. I... I promise. But... but have they hurt the city? I don't think they'll blow anything else up. Why? Because we surrendered, I hope. Well, what are we going to do, Arthur? We're brothers. I'll look out for... We'll look out for each other.
to sleep, perchance to dream. any other hatches to go to just yet. That's the first fight I've won since primary school. Actually, I think it's the first fight I've been in since primary school. in the parade district, which I just got chased out of. Brilliant. Ah, the train station. If I can get to the train station, I can just follow the old rail tunnel all the way to the bridge. It'd be nice if there was a map, wouldn't it? I suppose back in those days, we could remember where things were. Sorry to bother. I hope this doesn't give me food poisoning. No, just rest in my feet. You've got to find something to eat.
benefit of Mr. Kite, the rabbit got into the garden. The rabbit got into the garden. Sounds like some sort of secret message. coming for you, Percy. I haven't got it all figured out, but I will find you. I wonder if changelings were just what people used to call people like Percy. Rose of Gilead. Percy told me about these. They're good for wounds and things. Maybe I can make some sort of ointment to put on my wounds. Otherwise, I'll never feel better. I wonder if he ever figured it out. Why I wasn't on the train. Percy, I'd just go promenading about, wondering why everyone was staring. I mean, never did quite grasp what's so important about wearing clothes. sandwich. What's on those beds? Oh, God. I'm not the only one remembering the children, am I? Makes sense. They're all off their joy out here. A toy tea set. Funny, Percy never played with toys. He didn't like anything that wasn't really the thing it was supposed to be. A toy tea set. Funny, Percy never played with toys. He didn't like anything that wasn't really the thing it was supposed to be.
Getting a bit thirsty. I better find something to drink. Where's a pub when you need one? There's a pump on Barrow Home, isn't there? That'd be ironic. Die of thirst in England. Well, to fill up a canteen or two, shouldn't I? Anxious to get back home to the village? Well, I... Uh, well, I live in the parade. <laughs> you won't get past that door. Not without one of them disposable electrical cars that all the bobbies have. And a power cell. Know where I could mug a bobby? <laughs> You're a brave one, aren't you? No. I'll trade you one. Don't you want to go back home? Home to all those bastards who chased me out of my house. When they all catch the plague and die, then I'll go back. There's something I want a whole lot more. Those bastards in that camp over there, with the helmets and the proper weapons. They took something from me. If you get them back from me, I'll give you my card. Sounds quite dangerous, isn't it? Of course it's bloody dangerous. That's why I'm paying you. Come and find me in that sort of hamlet over there. We'll trade. All right. Well, what are they? Me medals. From the war. I won the DSO at Dunkirk and the Victoria Cross at Ramsgate. Those bastards. They thought it was funny that I still had them. Fucking funny they thought it was. No, oh, I'll need a power cell to fire this thing up. Who'd have store most of those too? Right. Well, I'll see what I can do. Well, off I go to a camp of robbers. Maybe I can defeat them with my rapier sharp wit. Hard to believe people fast on purpose. This ought to be pretty clean. Unlike in the village, where they spike it with joy.
heavens alive. It's a bloody fortress. They look pretty well buttoned up. I suppose I can wait here till they throw a party for the whole neighborhood. Or find a cleverer way in. Sally would have loved this if I could never get in here. I guess I have to take that elevator. I hope no one notices. Fred? A lovely day it is. Not many people get this far. It's sort of a test. Someone who gets this far usually puts up a decent fight. In the arena. I don't suppose there's some way I could be more useful to you alive? I don't know. Can you juggle? Well, I can write a lovely poem. I won a prize in school. Nah. We've already got a bad. First, put your things in that box. I will leave you there to starve. Gird thy loins for the moment of truth, for it is upon you. Gentlemen, 
is our two-time winner, Janet Defoe! Bloody hell! Arthur Hastings? I'm sorry? I, I don't... I don't think I know you. Of course you know me! You got me sacked from the old current! I, uh... I, I don't remember that. I, I, I don't work there anymore. You thought one of my articles was insufficiently original? Danny Defoe! You, you've lost a bit of weight. To be fair, you did copy my piece line by line. Who gives a shit, Hastings? A newspaper's supposed to make you feel good. Nobody remembers what they read. I don't want to fight you. The feeling is muted. There's only enough food for the winners, see? Now let's choose your weapons. One is quite lethal. The other will just give the other chap some bad dreams. Up to you. That padded one doesn't look nearly as effective. How badly do I not want to kill good old Danny? And Danny's picked the least for one. That's cheery. Hey, tall guy. I've got great odds on you. Don't fuck it up. He's got to come on strong with that lead pipe. You've got to want to block that. I've got a sinking feeling. Oh, 
Oh God, this shot. Oh God. Some sort of vent. I wonder if I can pry it loose. I'd need a jimmy bar. I don't have a jimmy bar. Can I find stuff to make one with? I'm gonna have to search these bodies for bits and bobs of metal, aren't I? I suppose now that no one is actively trying to kill me, I ought to be on the lookout for a Motelin dispenser. Now that no one is actively trying to kill me, I ought to be on. I better figure out how to get rid of him real quiet like. I definitely don't want a crowd. You've got a bloody no See the violence inherent in the system. 